Hey sightseers, today's adventure brings us to an area of the world that many of us are unfamiliar with, and that is outer space. On October 4, 1957, the Soviets became the first to successfully launch an artificial satellite and place it into the Earth's orbit. Thus began the Space Age. The Soviets continued to experiment with their space program and on March 15, 1960, launched the Korobol Sputnik 1. The Korobol Sputnik 1, or the Sputnik 4 as it was dubbed in the West, had a pressurized cabin and life support. This launch was to be a test flight for the Soviets' manned space program. Five days after launching, something went wrong and instead of returning to Earth, Sputnik 4 drifted off into space. That is, until September 6, 1962, when it fell from the sky. When the Sputnik 4 fell from the sky, all seven tons of it burned up in the atmosphere, with the exception of a 20-pound hunk of metal which crash-landed here on Earth. Today we're going to check out the very spot where this hunk of metal crash landed in the street. By the way, for more cool content, check out my other videos and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. We're here! It is my understanding that there is a display inside the museum and we'll go inside here in a moment and check that out. This museum actually used to be the home of a rather influential family here in town, known as the West Family. Sputnik Fest? I wonder what that is. Surprisingly, the museum's display commemorating the Sputnik 4 crash landing is tucked away in the basement of the museum at the end of a hallway. This here is an actual replica of the piece of the Sputnik that crashed here in Manitowoc. The real hunk of metal was returned and the Soviets sent the museum a replica. These are the two officers who discovered the hunk of metal in the street, Officers Marvin Bouch and Ronald Rusbolt. This steel expert was called in by local police to aid in the identification of the metal. Some people believe that instead of the test dummy, like the Soviets claimed was on the Sputnik, that actual human beings were manning the spacecraft. Unfortunately, we'll never know the truth, as the craft burned up when it re-entered the Earth's atmosphere. Did you watch Tuesday's vlog? If so, you'll now know what that metal ring in the middle of the street was for. For those of you who want to check this out for yourselves, this crash site is located in Manitowoc, Wisconsin, directly in front of the RAR West Museum at the corner of 8th and Park Street. And here's a placard that's actually in the sidewalk rather than for you to stand out in the street. Surprisingly, it is located almost dead center in the street. Oh, and that Sputnik Fest? That's a chance for the locals to celebrate the crash landing of a piece of space age history. 
Don't forget to subscribe.